Willkommen, bienvenue, and welcome back to Blood Bowl Chaos Edition with Light. Last time we trounced a couple of rats, 4 nothing victory over the Skritz Razor Claws. Today, not sure who we're going to be playing, but we've got Gnartigors here with an extra skill. We've got 50k in the bank, not quite enough to buy another Beastman, certainly not enough for a Minotaur. So let's get to the next match. See what we've got. Their value, 1340 versus my 1020, so we've got another 320 to spend. So the question is, do we want to take Grashnak again? Do we want uh, Borak the Defiler? Do we want extra rerolls and coming back from KO? Mm, all sorts of choices. We did Grashnak last time, so let's do some of this. So we'll buy two of these for 100k and then get some extra team training. Get some extra rerolls. Because Kemri here, they're big, strong, and nasty. We only kind of it, hmm, yeah, we're we're likely going to have to play like elves. And for Chaos to play like Elves, they need re-rolls. Badly. Real bad. Now these Kemri, they're good old-fashioned uh, mummies and skeletons and undead type things. But as such, they've got Tomb Guardians. They're basically the cursed mummy that you always see in everything. I'm not sure how many they've got, but... It's more than they should. So we're here in the uh, icy arctic wastelands. Not entirely sure whom, whose home field this is. Because I doubt it's mine, but it really shouldn't be theirs either. Uh, heads or tails, heads or tails, let's go for tails. Okay, choose the team role. We're not going super bashy this time, so let's receive it. <laughs> While we've still got all our guys on the field. Uh, let's see. Let's move you up. You up as well. We need to guard them close. And they need to spread out for us, because we're going to try to use our superior agility. Yeah, that's right. Superior agility of chaos against them. Blitz! Ooh, that's them. Oh, man. Okay. Hmm, he's right where the ball's going. Here's hoping he drops it. Otherwise, we are going to have a bad time. Drop. Ooh, that guy got it. Oh, jeez. Well, guess it's time to put him on the ground. I'll take that pow, and yes, I'll fall. Mm -hmm. You come around here. I do not want this to turn into a scrum. I'll take that pow. Straight back. Do not follow. Let's see what else we can do. We can bring this guy up in here. This guy should now have a good block on him. There we go. I'll take that, pal. Do not follow. Instead, pick up the ball. Well, that's nice. Um, now what? Pretty sure my best bet is to run away. 
Remember, play like elves. Play like elves. Okay. Which means you need to come up over here as well. Right there, if possible. Do not fall down. Do not. Okay, use one reroll already. Lovely. Now this guy can come over here and try to do something, but this guy can't get to him, so best case for them, one die block on my guy. I can live with that. I do not like one die blocks, though. Let's hit this guy. Oh, we can get a good hit on a couple of these guys. Eventually, we'll have something like that. Oh, but his regeneration saved him. I don't know if I got star player points for that. Uh, let's see. You. Mark this guy. Nothing good here. Absolutely nothing good here. And I'll just mark them such that they don't go after the guy that's important. <clears throat> yep, you had to do it. But you don't have strip ball. Oh, but you... Oh, he had to go for it. Down you go! <laughs> okay, so this guy needs to dodge out and make a break for it, or have this guy blitz him out, but then this guy would have to dodge. So, all in all, dodging's the way to go. I don't have any actually good blocks, so he's just gonna go for it. It's a ridiculous plan. But this guy's got a speed of six, so anywhere I go, he's gonna follow me. I just need to roll some dice. Pass that one. Pass that one. Oh! Tries to trip over the goal line. <laughs> <clears throat> and our extra rerolls have already come in handy. So glad I went for that, because you can't stand toe to toe with Kemri with Chaos. Chaos just doesn't have the strength. Uh, because every one of these guys with the fancy hats, strength five. Which means they get two dice against my big guys who are only strength four. Okay, so I'm kicking off. Let's bring these guys up just a little. <clears throat> we can't play these guys very tight. Because they can just annihilate us. Oh! We get to blitz this time. Problem is... We don't want to play tight. <laughs> well, let's get these guys in here. That is a bad idea, but we'll see. That's as good as we're going to get for this one. We just need to keep a line that they can't just walk through. And, wow! Even with sure hands, he dropped the ball. <clears throat> now, let's see. Bad. Worse. Bad. Bad. Um, there's no clean way in. 
This is oh, two dice his way because this guy isn't helping. Best I could get there is a one die block. This one's Nartagors. So he is okay with one die blocks. <clears throat> Give him the horns! Ooh, I've got block. He doesn't. Down he goes. Not what I wanted. But good enough. Let's come in, give it a little assistance, which generates even more one die blocks. here to give the assist to get this one die block. Reroll that. Aw, oh, double skulls. Yeah, I'm flying through these rerolls. I really should play more conservative than this. We'll see how it goes. Blitz any blitz. Who are you blitzing? Okay. He was the one closest to the ball. I can appreciate that. Okay, now that almost opens up a lane for them. Ooh, down he goes. Okay, so what can we do? We've got a lane in here that we need to open up. So that requires this guy to knock that guy down. But first, we stand people up. The more people standing, the more dice they roll, the more likely they are to fall down. Oh, we've got a clear lane here. We can just walk in and hit him. <clears throat> kind of want to have extra people there for when he drops the ball, though. So... We'll try this one first. If we can get multiple people... Nope, that would close down the lane. Yeah, we'll follow. Now I can dodge... in and try to do something, but that's... that's not a good plan. So we want to go one, two, three for hit. Mm. Reroll's just gonna make it worse. It's risky, but worth doing. Now you can't hit that guy any better because this guy's still not helping. One dice there. Who are you? Spratagor. Tyler Snout. Togor. Ratagor. Nartagors is over here. Got a whole lot of bad blocks over here. And a super bad one there. I'll just end it. It's not worth throwing bad blocks. Ding dong. Uh, no. They're likely to kill one of my guys. Do not want to waste an apothecary on... Just a KO. Okay, so they freed up the ball. What are they going to do with it, though? Ooh. Not nearly enough. Yeah, my biggest hope with these Tomb Guardians is for them to do something stupid and knock, them out of, <laughs> knock themselves out of the game. 
With strength five, you're tempted to pull all your people around, get good blocks on them. But then you're not playing the game anymore. You're just trying to kill those guys. They just take the ball and run it. Okay, so bring this guy here. You just stand up. You stand up. You stand up. Hello? Oh, he's face down. Okay. Now you. Oh, you get a good hit. That's not how that's supposed to work. I should not get my horns bonus from the ground. But I'll take it. Really? Pushing again? Let's push him here, try to hit him again. Okay, now this... Oh, he's already done stuff. I'll take that, pal. Let's put him on this side. Ding dong! Uh, let's see, what else do I have? Can I get in here? I can! It's always good to have another guy on the ball. Bad news here, you. One, two, three, four, five, six. Good enough. I'll take it. Just need to stall him. There's quite a few turns left to stall him, but I... That's what I'm here for. Ding dong. Nope. I've got the blood wiser babes for that. Just need to get to the half. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can put my guys on the ground. It's fine. One of these days you're going to try to dodge and it's not going to go well for you. Or you'll do that. <laughs> okay. So, all sorts of bad news everywhere. I want this guy to hit that guy, but he needs some help. And there really isn't any help to be had. So we'll put this guy here. Stand him up. Stand him up. Stand him up. Uh, all this guy can really do is stand up as well. Do you have guard? You do not. Do you? No. Good. Dodge and stand here. Good, good, good. Now you... Blitz him. Hit him from the ground. I'll take that, pal. And I will follow. Uh, no. I've got too many people. I'm never going to catch that ball. But that's good. I've got two people on the ball. You can't throw a good hit. You can't throw a good hit. End my turn. Push me onto the ball. Oh. Okay. Now who's gonna try to pick it up? Nobody? Can't win if you don't pick up the ball. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> yep, they're all out of rerolls. Okay, so now we just need to get people next to the ball. Hello, person. Person number two. 
You stand up. You one die. Lame. You stand up. You blitz yourself next to the ball. I'll take it. Not what I wanted. One, two, three, four, five. No. There we go. Yes, re-roll that. Okay. We've at least got two people next to the ball. This one's going to fall down. This one, they would need to blitz. I'm good with making them blitz. One die block. Two dice his way. Two dice his way. And... Okay. Do what you're going to do. Oh! -ho -ho! Double skulls! They didn't show it to us, but that's what he had to roll. That was the only way I had any chance on that one. Okay, now you could two die block just about anybody. Let's take out this guy. I'll take that pal. Do I pow him up here or pow him onto the ball? I'm not going to pick up the ball, so let's pow him up there. You. Knock him into next Sunday. Next Sunday it is. Straight over. Do not follow. You. That's no good. You need some help. You. Need some help. That's good. Uh, yeah, let's follow him. Let's send him flying. Uh, no. Stay next to the ball. Now this guy is free. I could blitz that guy. Let's do it. I'll take that, pal. Oh. No. Let's put him over there. Awesome! Badly hurt. Oh, regeneration, no star player points for me. Oh, maybe I can pick up the ball. Ha <laughs> ha! Unexpected. But it's my last turn of the half. Are you face up or face down? I can't tell. Let's not make it easy for him. Okay, over here. Two, one, two, two, two. End of turn. Yeah, yeah. Good luck with that. So, he rolled a double down. He had block. That's how it goes. Drop the ball. Oh, sure hands. Oh, right. He's the one who's supposed to pick up the ball. But thrower is not throwing it. And we're both down. That's the end of the half. Managed to get through the first half just with that one score. All in all, that's pretty good. I mean, these Camry are not to be trifled with. But we did manage to get two of them dead off the field and one knocked out. So we might have a numerical advantage now that we got these two back. With the Bloodweiser babes, it becomes significantly easier to get your guys back from KO. 
So nice. So we're back to pretty much full strength. And they... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9? Yeah, they're down too. So numerical advantage, huge. Organized players before kicking off. This is where we were last time, so it's good this time. Drop it right in the middle. Boink! Gentle breeze. A bounce, bounce, bounce. Okay. Managed to pick up the ball. He is the throw rye. That's his job. Not entirely sure if there's a catch Ra. <laughs> Who can actually catch the ball, because these Tomb Guardians certainly aren't going to. Blitz Ra. Not gonna catch it. Ow. Ow. Big guy coming back for support. Okay, so let's take a look. Agility 2, not catching the ball. Agility 2, not catching the ball. Agility 2, what on earth are they planning to do? Agility 1. Yeah, he's the only one who can really do anything with the ball. So I need to kill him. New plan. Kill the throw Ra. But for now, play like elves. We need to squishy cage them such that they can't hit us, but they also can't move. We'll keep these guys busy right here. Yes, they'll knock my guys down, but it's not going to be too easy for them. And the more dice they roll, the more chance they have of falling down. What's your strength? Three? <clears throat> Here we go. Getting everybody into position. Oh, that wasn't what I wanted to do. Still worked anyway. I'll have to go for it to hit him, so I will not. Okay. So that's all that. Let's end that turn. City Blitz. Okay. I'm good with that. You haven't opened a lane for the throw raw. They should cage him up, because they're Kemri. They hit hard. Cages are for teams that hit hard. It's a bad cage, though. It's a real bad cage. Look at that open space. Right in here, right in that corner. You can just sneak in and destroy him. And if we take out the uh, throw raw, they're never picking up the ball again. Not really. Because even with sure hands, that guy drops the ball. Rawr! <laughs> My turn? Come on! Hand it over, there's nothing more you can do. Okay. So the real thing to do is to blitz. Like that. Um, however, this guy's gonna offer a bit of assistance. So I'd only really get a one die hit. And 
two, three, four, five, six. Who are you? Rakdor, Werfagors, Togor. You stand up. One of these guys has guard, doesn't he, that guy? That's annoying. Okay. Okay. This is our good shot. Push. I'll take it. Good hits. Ding dong. Oh, oh, Nartigors. There we go. Okay, so they've gotten everybody off the ball. Now, what do you do? Push. Oh, that was not a good plan. Now that guy's free and clear. Okay, do not trip over your own hooves. Oh, tripping over his own hooves. Okay, you stand up. You take him out. Okay, so let's try a dangerous maneuver. Dangerous maneuver. Oh, man. Knew I shouldn't have done that. But it was just so tempting. Smashed hip? Okay, that I will use an apothecary for. Now, with badly hurt, he just goes back into the reserves. He'll be back the next time something big happens. Yeah, smash tip is no joke. That slows him down, and that's a bad, bad thing. Ooh. Drop the ball. Now. What do I do? I really should dodge this guy out over to here. Uh, actually, over to here. Make him blitz me. Really? Two dice, you couldn't make that roll? It's just embarrassing. He hits this guy, pushes him away, but now there's nobody to pick up the ball. Oh, that guy. How on earth did he pick up the ball? He's got agility one. He had to roll a six to pick up the ball. A six on a six-sided die. That's... Mm. Okay. Well, you stand up. You go up here. You stand next to that guy.
You stand here. It's a very elfy thing to do. And you guys just keep having a stalemate with those guys. Yes. Ding dong. That's fine. Pushity <clears throat> push. Okay. So what I need to do is just make them not get all the way down here in the next two turns. My best chance of doing that is blocking their lanes without giving them any good hits. Unfortunately, it's not as easy as it sounds. Because this guy can still come in and blitz that guy out of the way. need is a push. I'll take that, pal. There we go. That's good. You just stand up. And you are not throwing a one-die block. Good. Two more rounds and then we win. Hard-fought match. Hey, look. He's doing exactly what I said he would. Come on, somebody else throw a block up here before the guy runs with the ball. Come on, somebody fall down. I know you want to fall down. Ooh, this guy over here. Oh, ha, 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 ha. Tempting fate like that and he didn't fall down. Yeah, they've done a lot of agility-based things for a Camry team. He didn't run the ball. Like, is he mathematically eliminated from scoring? That's the only reason not to run the ball. Well, I'm definitely not going to be scoring. So, I'm just going to hit this guy, try to get some star player points. Get him! Ah, uh, no good. One die block, got rerolls, let's take it. Yeah! Nope. No good. This is two dice his way. One die block here. I'll take that pal. Okay, good enough for me. They're not going to score, so I've won this game. It's just a question of whether or not all my people are going to survive this last turn. Looking good so far. He runs it, but he can only make it so far. I don't know if he realizes it's the end of the game. And there's the end. Do I want to do a little more punishing? Do I have any good hits? There we go. It's not how horns is supposed to work, but I'll take it. Nope. 
No good hits. That's the end. So, a one nothing victory. Still a victory, but don't really feel good about it. Camry do hit really hard. But, thank goodness, none of my guys got any serious, lasting injuries. We brought the apothecary, worked out for us. Really glad we went that way, because smashed hip makes that guy pretty much useless for the rest of the season, really. So here we are, emptying the stadium. Let's see our results. I rolled a two. Yes, I want to re-roll. There we go, rolled a five, got some more cash. Spent most of the game in the opposition half, got some more fans. Match rating nine out of 20. They were apparently not pleased with my showing. With a 1-0 victory, I don't blame them. Um, MVP, Dogor. Yeah, MVPs are picked randomly. It, it's just weird. And then we come back here, find out if anybody leveled up, and they did not. We've got 110. We can't fit any more Chaos Warriors in our roster, so we can't buy one of those. We could buy a spare Beastman if we wanted, but uh, I'm on the fence about that. Might want to save up 40 more to get a Minotaur. We'll see. Might just want to keep some money in the treasury for buying random extra inducement things. So if we look over here, we've got Stairclap at five. We've got Togor at five because he was the MVP. So those two were the MVPs. They need one more point to get a skill. We've got uh, Tyner, Werfagors with three apiece from touchdowns. Uh, Linegor, I believe, got a touchdown last game, so he got a casualty this game. Each of these twos is a casualty. So only need one more point for Linegor. A good casualty, or another touchdown for Werfagors and Tyner. Anybody else... It'll take two things or an MVP to get him a skill. But we're getting to a fairly critical point. Uh, Spratagor doesn't have anything, but pretty soon we're going to be getting a lot of extra skills. Once everybody's got block, that'll be a great day. But for now, that was a nice game against Kemri. We didn't do too great, but not too bad. So I will see you in the next episode of Blood Bowl Chaos Edition with Light. <laughs>